Today I'll give you eight proven strategies to ace university. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel where we talk about self-improvement, self-growth and time management. Okay, let's not waste time today and let's go right into the video. Step number one, we need to set goals. Setting goals have a direction, focus, attention and motivation. So what do I mean by setting goals? For example, a goal can, can it be revise all of your classes every week. Step number two, be disciplined. So let's say that you set a goal for yourself that you want uh, to revise all of your classes every week. So whenever you have the exams, you want to feel overwhelmed with, uh, with all of it. You need to be disciplined and you need to stay consistent with that goal that you set uh, for yourself every week. Thing that really helped me to stay consistent with my goals in regards to the university is it is to have other things to do. So for example in my case I have the gym uh, so I have gym, I have work, I have university and that's pretty much what I have. Uh, so usually for me to be um, you know more disciplined I also put other, th other things for example I put four times the gym then I have work so whenever I put slots to study I really have to study on those slots because otherwise able to do anything so having more things besides university really helps you to stay consistent and to be disciplined within your goals step number three is my favorite step and your this one we need to set realistic uh, schedule it's a key step to, su to succeed at university trust me when i say this so when you're doing our schedule we need to be realistic within you know with yourself we can use the amazing and wonderful time blocking i also i made a video about this you can i'll leave the link below if you're interested on it. An app that I really use and it's been helping me for ages is Senseima. If you want to try it, I'll also leave the link below where you can try for 30 days free. It's awesome and it, it literally, it's a no-brainer to join Senseima because you have focus mode. Um, it also tells you if you're being realistic within your schedule or not. So it's literally a friend telling you, you know, you also have to rest. So I definitely recommend Senseima for everyone. Number four, revise the chapters before your class. So before we ha you have a class, you know, you already know what your tutor teacher, you know, will present you on, will teach you, right? So usually at least in my university, teachers, they um, download the matters on uh, our platform, which is a Blackboard, so I can actually access to it before. And that's key. That's key to, to also for your notes. That's, I, I can't stress enough how important uh, this is. So before your class, you will check the chapters. I don't know if you guys work uh, with platforms, uh, you know, online platforms or with books, uh, but if either way, just check the chapter before you go to the class, read, usually read like what is in italic or bold because that's the key aspects that your teacher will, you know, um, approach within, will tell you in the class or will teach you. Tip number five guys, the most important of all, attend the classes. Really, it's that simple. Just go attend the classes and make sure you learn something. Obviously, when you go to the class, take notes of the class. Then, the step number six is complement this step. So basically, on your step number six, you will have your PowerPoint, your books and your notes from your classes and then you just combine. And this is the key guys, for when you have exams, when you have essays, the time of exams reaches, you already have your notes, you have 
you already have your summary so you literally just need to revise it this is what I do this is what enables me of being a really really good student while I work and have other things to do so I hope you like this video guys this helps you to be a better student please let me know if you like this video so I can do more videos like this I hope you have an amazing week and I might do a video about a week at uni so stay tuned